Hey guys, what's going on? Frank Rich here from Rebuilt Recovery. And in today's video, I want to talk to you about how to deal with and manage the judgment that you may be receiving from others and ultimately get out of your own head and begin to take the steps to remove porn from your life for good and ultimately become the man that you were created to be. But before we jump into today's video, guys, let me remind you who we are and what we do here. Welcome to the Rebuild Your Life YouTube channel. My name is Frank Rich, CEO, founder, and head coach at Rebuilt Recovery, and it is our mission to help men break free from the shackles of porn addiction through the power of faith and fitness. And we do that in a handful of different ways. First off, right here on YouTube, we are releasing new videos every single day, Monday through Friday at this point. So if you're new to the channel and haven't done so yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also turn those post notifications on so you are notified every time a new video is released. And secondly, guys, if you're in the early stages of removing porn from your life for good and, and are curious about what your life can look like once you've been able to move past this addiction, make sure to pick up our free ebook. It's the seven step guide to living life without porn, where we walk you through how to actually build a vision for your life once you've removed porn from it, how to put that vision into an actionable plan that you can execute, execute upon every day, and then ultimately, where do you need to find the motivation, discipline, and accountability to make this dream become a reality? So pick up the free book, guys. Uh, but let's get back to today's topic, guys. Dealing with and managing the judgment that you may be receiving or think you're going to receive from others when it comes to your porn addiction. So, so I, I, I know the feeling, guys. I want to share with you a little bit about my own personal journey. Because for 20 years, as I've shared here on this channel and as I share on the podcast, the Superman Life, for almost 20 years, I was dealing and battling with this addiction. And it was deep. I was deep in the, in, in the darkness of being addicted to porn. And I think for a lot of those years, it was the fear of what others were going to think about me when, you know, if I were to, to come out about it or if I was to share it with anybody. And when I had the breakthrough moment, when I realized that no matter what anybody says about me, there is no comparison to the things that I've said about myself. Okay, let me, let me repeat this so it can really kind of settle in. There's nothing that anybody in the world is going to say about me that I already haven't thought about or said to myself before. And I can tell you the conversations that I've had with my own self are much more harsh, much more extreme, and come from a much darker place than anything that anybody else is gonna say about me. And I wanna empower you to, to shift your perspective in the same way. So think about it, guys. What are the conversations that you're having with yourself on a daily basis right now? What are the, some of the things that you've said about yourself? Because here's the truth of the matter, guys. Like, yeah, there's people in your life that have impact, have influence, and ultimately you want to do good for. But the only person that you have to live with every single day for the remainder of your life is yourself. So if the conversations that you're having with yourself on a regular basis, and we all do, it doesn't matter where we are in our stages of life. Still to this day, still to this day, I've, I've removed porn from my life. I know exactly what my life's mission is. But still to this day, I, I, I live with the, the, the doubt. I live with the insecurities. Like this is part of human nature. We don't believe in ourselves like we truly should. It doesn't matter who you are. This is why you need like a spiritual practice. You need to, to connect with and resonate something beyond who you are. Because if you rely simply on yourself, like your chances of success are, are minuscule. But I wanna, I, wanna, I wanna remind you guys that the conversations, the things that you're having about yourself or the things that you're saying about yourself are in no comparison to what anybody in the outside world is gonna say about you. And when you shift your perspective to view the world that way, then ultimately it doesn't matter what another person says. It doesn't matter what their judgment of you is. Because here's the thing, guys, it's your life. You are the one that is gonna to have to live with this addiction if you don't take the, the steps and you don't take action to remove it. So are you, are, are you willing to let the judgment of others impact how you live your life? Or are you gonna step into your own greatness and realize that it doesn't matter what anybody outside of me says about me because I was put on this world and I was put on this planet for a purpose and in order for me to get aligned with that purpose I have to work on becoming the man that I was created to be so when you can when, so, so when you can shift your perspective about how others view you because here's the thing you know if, 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 if you come out in a social circle or you know if you walk into a group and you know, there's whispers about about this addiction, or you know, you're 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 worried about reaching out to me because you're you, you think that I'm going to judge you. Well, I can tell you that there's nothing that you and I would talk about that I haven't already heard before. 
Okay, so let me give you that confidence first. But you gotta move past this judgment because realizing you are the ultimate judge of your own life. Like, are you ready to live the regress of your life living in the state that you are right now, addicted to porn, unable to control these temptations, you know, guilt, shame, which we talked about yesterday uh, in our video. So you, you gotta shift your perspective, guys, and I think this is the key in taking action. This is the key in, in, in taking the first step. You know, there's, I, I, I can assume that there's a large amount of you right now watching this video that know you need to make a change, know you need to take action, but you're worried about what the other person is gonna say. You're worried about what your partner is gonna say. Well, if they're the right person and if they're the right partner in your life, they're gonna be proud of you for making the improvements on yourself. They're gonna be proud of you for identifying that there's a weakness right now that you need to work on and ultimately taking the, the action steps to, to become a better version of yourself, to become a better man, to become the man that you were created to be. So how do you deal with and manage the judgment of others? First of all, you gotta just change the way you view that and realize that judgment from others has no real impact on who you are in the life that you're living. You are the one that you have to live with every single day for the rest of your life, okay? Let me repeat that. You are the only person that you have to live with every single moment of every single day for the rest of your life. So knowing that the way that you judge yourself, the conversation that you have with yourself and the things that you say about yourself are way more harsh, way more extreme, and have a much larger impact on you than anything from the outside world is ever gonna do for you. So, dealing with it, guys, is just a matter of shifting your perception of how you view yourself. So that's the path, guy. That's the key. And that is the beginning step to taking action to removing porn from your life for good. So I hope this video is valuable to you. If, if, if it was, drop us a comment down, down below. Let us know how this helped you. Let us know, you know where you're at in your journey. You know, uh, a lot of you are beginning to reach out to me on Instagram and sending me emails. And I love every single message. And I want more of those. Okay, so if you guys are, are, are in the beginning phases of this journey, reach out, share, connect. Let's get plugged into a community here. Uh, but if you haven't done so yet, like I said at the beginning of the video, make sure to pick up the free ebook, guys. It's Seven Step Guide to Living Life Without Porn. Uh, I'm going to link it down there in the first pinned comment, so it's very easy to access. And once you download the book, if you're curious about taking the next step and you're curious about, you know, hey, is this Reboot Your Life program, is the coaching program actually a right fit for me? Uh, once you download the, the, the book, you're going to be prompted to my schedule page where you can book a consultation call where all we're going to do is we're going to map out what your future can look like. We're going to discuss your underlying issue that you're dealing with right now and really try to get to the root cause of why you're still addicted to porn. And then we can figure out if, if working together is the right step. But grab the free book, guys. If you're new to the channel, like I said, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn those notifications on. Uh, but we'll be back next week with, with more videos to help you remove porn from your life for good and ultimately become the man that you were created to be. Frank Chris from Rebuilt Recovery. I'll see you guys on the other side.